Finally, plan 11C, five bedrooms, three baths, 3,100 square feet from 770,000. Uh, the curb appeal for me on this home, the colors, I you know, wasn't my favorite. I'm guessing all of these homes are smart homes. As you can see, as I'm walking through the house, especially in the front door, all the lights would turn on. Uh, but again, open floor plan, really nice finishes. I love the white cabinets. That's just my personal opinion. I just think it makes the home really nice and bright. So moving into the backyard, uh, one thing you're going to want to double check on with the builder is the patio. I don't know if that is an upgrade or standard that comes with this model, but sometimes you know that could be an extra twenty or thirty thousand dollars. And if I said it earlier on the video, put some money towards the backyard or save some money because it will be dirt. Uh, here is the pantry. And it's really nice that all of the larger models do have a three-quarter bath downstairs as well as a bedroom, office, whatever you want to make it. They've had, they made this an office, but of course it is a bedroom. Okay, so moving upstairs, very similar to the other 3,000 square foot models. It does have a really nice entertainment uh, area. You could put an office up there, uh, an area to, for the kids to do homework along there, along the wall, a uh, nice sitting area. And it is, again, very bright up here. Uh, not necessarily a fan of of the back wall there but uh, you know to each their own here is the shared bathroom and it's a dual sink which not all of them had dual sinks so that is definitely a plus if you have kids that want to fight 